Okay, if you're looking for a classic M4, you're not gonna get better than this. This is the SRC M4 A1, and this is the Gen 3. We've sold these ever since we um, first started many years ago. They are an absolute sort of gun. They're a Gen 3, which means they have the eight millimeter bearings, um, full metal gearbox. These are indestructible guns. These are very, very good guns. So we do this in black and in blue, I think, and also the two-tone orange, which I'm gonna show you now. Weighty, solid metal gun. Unblocking rod. Small box of BBs to get you started. In here, this bit here, I can, I can probably get it out, yeah. This is a adjuster for the front sight. You put it on the front sight and you can adjust the height of the front sight. Um, you also get another spring, so you can hot swap the springs over and you can change the spring over. This actually spring is a, this is the M120 spring, which is 400 FPS. That comes in the box as well, with your Gen 3. Now onto the gun. Oh, straight away, the weight of it. The receiver is full metal. Everything on it is full metal, apart from the ABS orange parts. So adjustable stock, I think it's four, three or four, four. Four settings, I think, on there. Solid metal, everything's metal. This comes off at your, well, that's, that's tough. Might need to get some grips on that. Anyway, underneath there, front one's tough. Underneath there is a rail system, so you can put your scope, red dot on, the, on there. Um, full metal, absolutely incredible. Really nice markings from SRC as well. You have your navy seal. And also the mag is really nicely marked up as well with uh, markings. Full metal magazine. So select a switch just on one side, your normal sort of safety, semi-automatic and full auto. Your hop up is underneath the dust cover. So you just pull back the charging handle, releases that, you can see hop ups there. That's just that little dial there for your hop up. Everything is metal, everything is positioned. Really beautiful, the feel is incredible. Really nice small trigger, M4 trigger, and that is all metal as well. Beautiful, really, really nice. Your battery goes in the front here. I'll just show you how to do that. You pull this um, delta ring, this is called. You pull this back and then that releases the bottom part and here is your battery. So your battery goes in here. Uh, either the block or the crane batteries will go in. Even uh, a LiPo, these are LiPo ready so you can put a small LiPo in there. It has, um, it's fused. So there's a little glass fuse in here which is really good. All the good guns are fused. So if there is a problem with a battery, it will not damage your gun. One of the top selling guns on the website, M4A1, has been ever since we started. And these SRC guns are really, really incredible. You can hot swap the front out as well. The front will come out and you can put a rail system on the front if you wish. This all comes apart and this can be moved forward so you can have an extended rail system. Because it's all metal, um, yeah, you can easily fit rail systems on the front of these guns or keep it as a classic M4. The other good point of these guns is you can get this gun, go to a skirmish, you definitely, definitely will not be embarrassed. This gun will perform as good as any other gun out there. Um, and then when you get your Yukara or your membership in the UK, you can buy these parts separately in black or you can take them off and just paint them but you can buy them in black and you just hot swap them over beautiful beautiful gun that is the gen 3 we do also do the standard one and the gen 2 just quickly the difference Gen 1 comes with standard parts, standard gearbox, um, standard motor. Gen 2 comes with 6mm bearings, um, 
metal parts within the gearbox and um, the standard motor. The Gen 3 comes with a much higher torque motor. It comes with a full metal gearbox and metal parts, comes with eight millimeter bearings. It basically is just indestructible. Well worth every penny. So take a look, that is on the website now. That is the SRC M4A1 in two-tone. Gen 3, as I say, and uh, that is a incredible bit of kit. Take a look on the website now in black as well, and I think we have it in two-tone blue, so the orange parts are blue. In fact, I don't think that grip's blue. I think it's just these two parts that are blue on the, on the two-tone. Have a look, it's on the website. Thanks for watching. See you again soon.